Hey everyone, I will be showing you on how to get different colored vests onto any saved outfit. There will be two different methods. One will delete outfits, the other one won't. I will be letting you know which one works for which. And also I will let you know which one works for old and new gen. And also which one works for the female male character. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe if you're new, share it with your friends. And now this works after the latest patch 1.67 as well. So let's get straight into the video. Now, I will be showing you on how to get coupled colored vests. Now, this one only works for the old gen GT5 and only works for the male character. Now, the other ones, the second method in this video works for all old and new gen and also the female and male character. Now, for this one, it, may, it only works for the male character, like I said, and only for the old gen GT5. Save your current outfit on the last outfit slot. Now open up your pods menu, go over to online and click swap character. Now you should be loading inside of a small room like this. Now once you do load in, you will need to go over to the second slot character and push edit. And if it says something about copying a rank over, just copy that rank. Now on the edit part, make sure it's a female character. And if it is, just go over to save and continue. And if you already have one, just go over to save and continue. And if it's a male character like this, over to the sex, put it a female, and push save and continue. Now you should be loading inside of a random GT5 online lobby. Now just open up your pause menu, go over to online, and load into an invite only session only because the clothing store should show up eventually. Now, once they do show up, go over to any clothing store on the map. Now, once you're there, you will need to go over to the accessories. Now, on the accessories, remove any sort of accessories that is on the female character including like gloves, wrists, earrings, chains, whatever. Any accessories, just re remove it. Now go over to the top section, go over to the fitted suit jackets, and you will need to buy the white molding blazer number 10. Now, basically, make your way over to the pants section, go over to the sport pants, and buy the spotted muscle pants. Should be the first one available. Now you will need to go over to the accessories, go over to the gloves, and buy the light woolen armored gloves, number 32. Now once you purchase those, make your way over to the shoe section, go over to the high heel boots, and purchase the 24th one, the deluxe midnight combat. Now what you need to do is open up your interaction menu, Go over to the inventory, go over to body armor, go over to the show armors. And you will need to put on the super light armor and go over to the front counter and save this as an outfit on the second outfit slot and just name it green armor. Now here's a word from hyperresupply.com. Do you want to be the richest person in GTA 5 online and never grind again? Well, check out hyperresupply.com. We are the number one boosting platform. We offer services for GTA 5, Forza Horizon 5, Need for Speed, and FIFA 23. We also have standard or express delivery time. If you're just looking into buying in-game currency or a modded account, we got you covered. We have the best deals, most legit, and 5-star ratings at hyperresupply.com. If you want to save even more money, go over to the checkout, use code REBEL to get 10% off your next order. Now, after you save that as an outfit on the second slot, back off in the front counter, go over to your inventory again, body armor, go over to show armor, put on the light armor, save that as an outfit on the third outfit slot, and just name it purple, or orange, excuse me, so just name this one orange. Now, back off in the front counter, go over to the body armors again, go over to the show armor and put on the heavy armor, and just save this as an outfit on the next outfit slot and just name it purple. Now back out from the front counter, open up your interaction menu and choose the option to easy way out. It should be at the bottom of your interaction menu. Now you should be spawning outside of the clothing store. Now once you do spawn in, you will need to open up your pause menu, go over to online and you will need to go over to creator and accept that alert that shows up on the screen. Now on this blue menu, go over to create race, click tutorial, accept that alert. Now open up your pause menu, go over to online, and you will need to go over to choose character and accept an alert that shows up on the screen. Once you load into this small room like this, 
Hover above the second slot character, which is the female character, and delete her, and accept the alert that shows up on the screen. Now, you will need to hover above the male slot character, and return to the GTA 5 story mode. That part is very important. Now, once you're in story mode, open up your pause menu like this, and load into an invite-only session. Now, once you're in the invite-only session, make your way over to any clothing slot on the map, and save your current outfit on the last outfit slot. Now this part is very important, basically you can make more modded outfits before we do this part or if you want the vest on to your saved outfit just make sure you have your saved outfit on right now or if you want to make modded outfits before, you can make modded outfits before. Now you will need to go over to your bookmark jobs and start up the mission called HGG thing. Now on this menu put the clothing on player saved outfit, invite at least one person to help you out and once they do join just basically launch the mission. And you should be loading inside of a job menu like this on the owned outfits if you scroll one or two or three to the right you should have a different colored vest like this now pick any vest you like now both are already up so the mission can start now you will need to basically once you do load in you should see the colored vest on your saved outfit or your modded outfits up to you still any of these street vehicles and make your way over to your apartment building and go inside of your apartment building you should know where it's at by now. Save your current outfit on the 19 outfit slot and delete the colored vest outfit that you already chose. And basically quit the job to the job to your phone and apply the saved outfit we just made. And you should see the colored vest on your saved outfit like this. Now it's up to you to make uh, more modded outfits. And you could just continue after making a modded outfit. Just start with the mission called Itchy G thing. And you know, just get the rest of the colored vest, and they should be there. And yeah, they should stick as well. But yeah, hopefully, you did enjoy this part of this video. Let's move on to the other part that does not delete no outfits. Now, I will be showing you an easy way on how to not delete no outfits for this method. Now, the only requirement is you need a black or a colored vest. If you do not have a colored vest, there will be a link down below in the video description on how to get the requirement so the requirement is you need at least one colored vest net cut and two consoles now this works for the female male character and old and new gen as well now you will need to make your way over to any clothing store on the map like i said you will need at least one vest and the vest that you need to get the color ones are the vests from the black joggers mission the work dispute now make your way over to any clothing store on the map save your current outfit with the colored vest or the black jogger vest the black one I name it C2 on any outfit slot, doesn't really matter. Now go over to the top section with your saved outfit and select any top that lets you equip the inventory body armor on. After you've done that, back out from the top section, open up your interaction menu, go over to inventory, go over to body armor. Now these are the armors that will give you different colors so if you want the purple you just go over to heavy armor or if you want the pink one you go over to super heavy armor and equip it on that makes sense now go over to the front counter afterwards now you will need to make sure you save this as an outfit and just name it c1 now back out from the front counter walk outside of the clothing store and equip a is there to bag on the interaction menu wait for the always loaded screen to show up and disappear now if you didn't have a is there two bag you can always buy one at any ammunition store you don't need to restart the glitch just equip it on after buying it now you need to go over to your neck cut. Now find your primary console and lock it. Now wait about 10 seconds after locking it. You will need to go over to console 2 and load up the GT5 application. And make sure you do not get kicked off console 1. Just leave them going in a circle your character. Now on console 2, load up the GT5 application. And if you're on old gen, load into story mode. Then an invite only session. And if you're on new gen, load into the main menu. Then... Load into a public lobby and if you're on Xbox, if it says something about end session there, just click end session there. Now once you do load in like this, open up your interaction menu, go over to style and select the C2 outfit and equip a parachute on. Wait for the orange loading screen to show up and disappear. And once it does, basically hold down on the D-pad, load into any story mode character if on origin. And once you're in story mode, fully close out the game. And if you're on new gen, just quit to the main menu and once you're on the main menu, you will need to basically close out your GT5 application by quitting it out. Now you will need to go back over to your net cut on your PC or laptop, whatever you're using it on, and unlock your primary console. Now close your net cut. Now you will need to go over to your console one. 
open up your interaction menu and remove the Israel tube bag. Wait for the always loaded screen to show up and disappear. Once it does, if you're on OGen, just you know load into story mode, then on story mode, load into invite only session. And if you're on new gen, just quit to the main menu. And on the main menu, just load into a public lobby. And basically, once you do load in, you should have the colored vest on your saved outfit. And basically, if this video gets up to like 120 likes, I will be showing you an easy method on how to transfer the colored vest onto another outfit without deleting no outfits. But this video has to have 120 likes. Catch you on tomorrow's video, which I post every single day. Don't forget to like this video. Subscribe if you're new. Peace.